See you in a minute, honey. All right, then. Daddy? Daddy, where are you? Here I am, Ailita. Daddy! I can't materialize myself into human form yet, as you can, Ailita. I still have more work to do on Lyoko. This world needs to develop more. Daddy, there are some strange-looking creatures over there. Run, Ailita, run! Daddy! Ailita! Huh? You know, young lady, most of us go to sleep at night. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Finney. In Scandinavian mythology, a natural disaster brings about the end of the Norse gods' world, scorching the earth before a new peaceful world can arise from the ashes called Ragnarok. And roll! <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Ragnarok and roll? <laughs> it was just a joke, sir. Very funny, Della Robia. And now, would you kindly leave this room? Uh, is that a joke? No, it's an order. Oh. I guess as jokes go, it wasn't very funny. So how is history class? Who cares? It's history now. Well, Miss Einstein, huh? I better get a good night's sleep. A super brain like yours needs a little shut-eye, and most of us, as you know, go to sleep at night. Of course, you don't have that problem, sissy, because your brains are in your feet. Isn't that a riot? Look who's got the nerve to talk about my feet, especially <laughs> after what Heidi Clear told me about yours. <laughs> what does she mean by that? What's wrong with my feet? Huh? Well, uh, to put it tactfully, when you take your shoes off, it's a little bit like, um... Like a pile of very fresh manure that we just can't seem to get away from. That's it! Oh, uh, come on, you're nuts! Well, what do you know? There's Heidi. Now we'll find out. Hey, Heidi, is it true my feet smell a little? A little. Just make sure you and your sneakers don't come within 50 feet of me. <laughs> <laughs> Reputation is a super stud is at stake. No girl is gonna want to go out with a uh, a walking pool of toxic waste. <laughs> Some friend you are, Ulrich. You could have said something, you know, uh, given me a little hint at least. It's hard to talk when you're holding your nose, good buddy. I thought you were trying to be funny. Don't worry, Odd. Modern medicine must have found some kind of cure for it. Well, there's amputation, <laughs> for example. <laughs> Start without me! Be right there! Uh, Emily, can I ask you something? When we went out together, did you notice that I... Uh... That your feet smelled? Better believe it. Why do you think I kept dousing myself in perfume? <laughs> Yolanda, I got a real problem. It's awful, I... Uh... Yes, 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 I know. You suffer from severe plantar perspiration. Say what? Your feet smell badly, Odd. Do you mean to say that everyone at school knows? No, there's... Uh, um, well, yes, everyone does know. But don't worry. I've seen cases that were a lot worse than yours, Odd. <laughs> oh? What's more, I know just what to do. Ailita. Daddy. 
I leader, I have to make contact with Xana and persuade him that we can live in peace with him. Who is Xana? A multi-agent computer program I created. It has achieved self-awareness and autonomy, and it's trying to eliminate us now. But why, Daddy? Daddy? Whatever you do, don't leave this tower. Daddy! 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 Ailita. Huh? Hey, what's the matter? Is anything wrong? No, I... I was... I was daydreaming, I guess. Hey, guys! No more feet nightmare. Call me Odorless Odd. How'd you manage that? You'll find that out tonight. It's a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll let you kick your foot problem around a little. I've got a math test. Jeremy, do you... Do you think my father's still alive? Huh? My father, Franz Hopper. Do you think it's possible to rematerialize him? No. Uh, what I mean is, well, there's no way to. But he managed to survive when Xana captured him the first time. Why not a second time? Your father sacrificed himself for you, Ailita. And he had to have used whatever little strength he had left in him to bring you back to life. I know, but but I thought there might be a hope. That maybe you could find a way. Impossible. I checked every inch of Lyoko, and there isn't the slightest sign of him. Ailita, I've been working really hard in a way of getting into the World Wide Web so that we can fight Xana, and you should think the way I think. I mean, think about the future. And just forget my past, huh? You think it's easy? You didn't spend 10 years of your life as some sort of computer software. Hmm? I wish I'd never recovered my memory. Get back to safety, in the tower! You possess the keys to Lyoko, I leader. Xana must never get his hands on them. Do you understand? It's over, I leader. Xana is too powerful. He's become a threat to all mankind. I've got to shut down the supercomputer. But does that mean we'll die? No, but you mustn't forget me. Ever, never forget, Ailita. Daddy. <laughs> I knew I'd find you here. <sighs> you know, our good buddy Einstein may be a computer whiz, but diplomatically, he's he's a a, a total lamo. But he really likes you. You know that. And I really like him too. I just wish he would understand that my father is all that I have left in my past life. Odd. I have to go to Lyoko. Uh -huh. Just to Sector 5. I want to try to find some trace of my father. Well, that may not be too easy. You heard what Jeremy said. He's not very anxious to help. So we don't need Jeremy, do we? Um, we? Just us. Just you and me. Okay, Odd? Um... Uh... Hey, Ulrich, do you think I was a bit too hard on Aelita? What do you think? It wasn't easy for her to learn that she was human. Better talk to her. No, Dad! you shouldn't talk to anybody. Huh? There's no talking permitted in a library. Anybody I find talking from now on is going to have a little conversation with me. And if you had not had enough, after our little chat, you can just walk down the hall and have a talk with the principal. No talking. This is awful. Lita must really hate me, huh? No, she doesn't. Hey, I bet she's running around looking for you to make up right now. Hey, William, did you study hard? Yep, just ask me anything you want about American history. Uh, that's great, but uh, the test is in math. Uh-oh. Okay, I'll launch the procedure which will automatically virtualize us in the desert sector. As soon as we materialize, we'll have one minute to get in sync with the transporter. Wow! You know how to do all that? Sure. Piece of cake. Oh no, an activated 
tower in the mountain sector. Okay, we're out of here. We can beat Xana if we act fast. Talk plan? Mm-hmm. I'm telling you, the recipe calls for huh? eggs, vinegar, whipped cream, a little wheat germ, and peanut. And I see you gotta use hazelnuts. You don't. You do. Uh-uh. Oh, we're not by any chance speaking too loud, are we, Jim? I want you two out of here immediately. Now go on, out of my sight, you hear? That was easy. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Hey, Ulrich, what was that recipe for anyway? It sounds totally gross. It's one of Odd's concoctions. Hello? Are you finished already? Yumi? Yumi's on her way. I can't seem to reach Lilita. You think she's still mad at me? I hope we didn't miss our bus. Smell that? It's weird. It smells as if Odd has been here. Forget it, Jeremy. Odd hasn't been here since yesterday. His feet smell, but not 24 hours later. Still, it's bizarre. Nothing from Aelita. Or Odd. Forget it. Looks as if Odd is angry as well. Because of his smelly feet? That's dumb. Odd is losing his sense of humor. I hope this isn't a false alarm. I raced through my exam. It's real, all right. I'm sending you and Ulrich in right now. The others will join you just as soon as I can get a hold of them. Transfer forward. Virtualization. Nice one, Jeremy. You materialized us in the middle of an air show. Sorry, you guys, but more surprises are on the way. Xana's called up his heavy artillery. I'll materialize your vehicles. Better hurry! <laughs> Look! Tarantulas! Super sprint! Long enough, now pick up. Look, the key, it's up there. This is almost too easy.
they were surprised to see us. Uh, sorry, uh, we're not disturbing you, are we? <laughs> But I also see a welcoming committee. Did you get hold of Odd and Ilita? Not a word. I'll try again. Stay in position for now. And don't get devirtualized. We'll try. <laughs> system online? Don't believe this, they're already there, the traitors! Ailita, Odd, I know you're there! For your information, while you're out there having a ball, Xana happens to be attacking. Ulrich and Yumi are already on the spot. What now, Ailita? Let's go. As soon as you get to the dome, I'll program a vehicle, and then I'll open a tunnel. The activated tower is in the mountain sector, okay? Now get going! Look, God! They're not attacking! It must be a game! Jeremy, we've just spotted some flying mantis at the south pole of the dome. They seem to be guarding the entrance. Now that is not a good sign. Hold on, I'll check it out. Uh-oh, looks like you were right. Xana's attacking the core of Lyoko. The tower in the mountain sector was just a diversion. Okay, we're on it! Kinesis thing is really cool. Or Yumi, change of plans. Listen up. Odd and Ailita are in Sector 5. You've got to get over there. They need some help. What? What's going on? I'll tell you all about it later. But for now, get going. Oh, it's suicide. You're kidding. This is a snap, Ailita. Xana really outsmarted us. While he kept us busy in the mountain sector, he was free to attack the core of Lyoko. Yeah, but he didn't count on two scanner stowaways already being in Sector 5. Fortunately. So then you're not mad at them? Not a chance. In fact, as soon as they get here, they're gonna each get a big kiss. Are you at the extreme edge of the sector? Sir, yes, sir. Okay, then I'll enter the code, Scipio. Ah, these guys are tough to get a handle on. You know, you might try throwing one of your shoes at them. Very funny. I can do better than that. Laser arrow! Ah. Hurry up! I leave us all alone! And the first shield layer of the core of Lyoko has just given way! Yumi and Ulrich are on their way. 
Uh, did we miss much of the show? No, just the opening act. My saber! Nice one, everybody. Alita, you know that you still have a tower to deactivate. But if you want to stop at a terminal first to collect some new data on Franz Hopper, uh, I mean, if you want to... Hmm. Yeah, why not? <laughs> okay, then. So what's this miracle cure that Yolanda gave you? Hold on! I did tell you it was a surprise. Now close your eyes, Ulrich. I'd rather close my nose, I think. Ugh! What's that foul odor? <laughs> it's a cream! Pretty effective, huh? Now my feet don't smell at all. That's because the stench of that cream is so horribly strong! <laughs> Oh. Help! Open a window or I'll die! Some guys are never satisfied! Any luck? No, nothing. Hold on a second, what's that? What have you found? A fragment of a DNA code sequence that belongs to Franz Hopper. Oh, you're right, Alida. My father might still be alive somewhere on Lyoko. Thank you.